I'm Pastor Ellie. I'm Pastor Kurt. And we're from Seven Seas Ministries. And welcome to our newest video. This one is called Fearfully and Wonderfully Made. Mm -hmm. And we're just going to talk for a few minutes about our bodies mm -hmm. and how God made us. And, you know, we, we were talking the other day. We say that a lot. <laughs> and, and as I was talking, it was like it just hit me that the words that I was speaking were not something that were written down. They were not prepared. I just spoke them. Mm. And it it was like this, I don't know, it was like this lightning bolt just like lit up in my mind. And I got this incredible understanding of how miraculous our bodies are. Mm -hmm. And the human brain, and I'm, I know next to nothing about the human brain. I'm no doctor. I'm not a scientist. So I don't Mm -hmm. have any knowledge really of that but the fact that a human can sit and talk and not have anything scripted mm -hmm. the the thoughts come out and go out as words <laughs> just like like that mm -hmm. and in mid sentence we can change the mm -hmm. direction we were going to go we could be on the very last word of the sentence and all of a sudden realize, wait, the tone should be this way and change mm -hmm. the tone mm -hmm. and change the meaning of what we're saying. <sighs> and it's just, it's mind blowing mm. that God created us the way he did. Mm -hmm. And if you, if you ever look at machine made things or technology, have you ever noticed that everything that man makes tries mm. to imitate what God has already done? Mm -hmm. Think about airplanes. Mm -hmm. God created birds and flying things, and so man had to figure out how to imitate that. Mm -hmm. And there are so many things in, you know, with computers and robots and things like that. They're all trying to imitate yes. what God <laughs> has already done. Mm -hmm. and, and, you know, I don't want to get off on all of that because that's not really the point, but... Think about how he has made us. Mm -hmm. He has made us to be able to see, to hear, to smell, to taste, mm. to touch. And those things all play into our lives right. in different ways. Mm -hmm. And yes, there are some people who can't hear. There mm -hmm. are some people who can't see. Mm -hmm. There are some who can't speak. But the, the ability or the... Um, the tools, for lack of a better word, so the parts of our bodies that do those things, mm -hmm. those are all still created by God. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I, I have contact lenses in my eyes. Mm -hmm. And I didn't have those for a long time. I've had them for a couple of years now. And even with contact lenses and glasses and things like that, it still never comes close to what God made. Yes, that's right. And I'm thankful for... The fact that we have contact lenses and, and <laughs> yeah. glasses available or we'd be in a lot of trouble. Right. But nothing compares to the wonder of our bodies that it, God created. I think of the parts, because I'm a woman, I think of the emotional part. Mm -hmm. You know, how we, we can cry and laugh and, mm. you know, yep. we can get firm when we need to. And mm. we know when we need to. It's yeah. just incredible how yeah. we know how to do these things and, mm -hmm. and to actually know how to use our body. You know, as we, you know, we're babies, of course, we have to learn. But as we reach a certain point, it just comes naturally. Like we mm -hmm. just learn to walk yeah. and run and... You know, yep. it's just amazing how God created us. And I just don't think sometimes we can even comprehend the no. the miraculous build of our bodies mm. and uh, people, humans. Yeah. I just don't think we no. give him the glory for really who he has made us to be. Right. And, you know, I don't think we should take that for granted. No, but I not think at we. All. And I think that we do sometimes. That in itself, we should be praising Him for. Every right. day we wake up and open our eyes and get mm -hmm. up. and just right. that's, We should praise Him because of who He has made us to be, the person. Yeah. And, 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 you know, the Bible says, in, in one translation, says that we're fearfully and wonderfully made. Mm -hmm. And it took me a long time, because of the way it was worded, it took me a long time to really get that. Mm -hmm. But when I started looking at different translations... And I don't have any in front of me to read, but they, they word it differently. Mm -hmm. They basically say, you know, we're, we are made 
in an incredibly awesome way mm -hmm. beyond and I'm I'm like expanding terribly on it right now mm -hmm. not like not terrible badly but like explain expanding on it in a way that says you know we are made in a way that our minds can't comprehend mm -hmm. our heads can't wrap around it mm -hmm. if we really seriously look at yes. the human body and 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 I I look at people like doctors and and how can a doctor know so much about the human body and not just be in constant awe mm. with God mm -hmm. because everything about our creation screams there was a creator mm. and that his his works are incredibly magnificent yes and you know I remember a time when I was in high school mm. and and I didn't have any um, spiritual upbringing you know mm -hmm. I was raised in a home where we kind of like figured maybe God is out there somewhere. Um, but, you know, we got dropped off at Sunday school once in a while, and that was kind of the gist of it. And But I remember being in high school, and I believe it was biology class, and I wasn't much for science. I didn't really pay much attention to it. It just I did what I had to do to get by and pass. Mm. Uh, but I remember seeing... I think it was a skeleton or part of a skeleton from a horse. Mm. And I remember seeing that there was a, a, like a tunnel going through the backbone of the horse. Mm. And that, that tunnel, you know, was like this big around, mm. about like that. And the teacher explained that that was where all of the nerves and oh, stuff passed wow. through, mm. going from different parts of the horse's body to the brain. Mm. And I remember wow. being in awe even yeah, then that's that, cool. wow, mm -hmm. who would have thought of that? Yeah. You know, well, God did. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, our, our bodies, and that was a horse, obviously, but we have the same thing. Mm -hmm. We have the same thing. And so we just wanted to put this out there and, and say, let's not take our bodies for granted. Right. Let's not take how God made us for granted mm -hmm. because Every single piece and part of us plays a role. Yes. Every single little piece of us has a purpose. Mm -hmm. And, you know, sometimes, like, you can take your hand and just, in a split second, without having to think about it, you can open and close your hand. You can move one finger. You can move, you know, a bunch of them or two of them or whatever. And, and sometimes, like, I'll do this and look at my arm and I can see... <laughs> I can, can see, see the tendons. Yes, I'm like, I know. That's when wow, I... Wow. You know, very, it's incredible. Yes, it is. And so we just wanted to kind of bring attention to that mm -hmm. and, and help so that nobody will take for granted mm -hmm. how God has made us. Yes, amen. And that we will constantly give God glory and honor and praise mm -hmm. even for these bodies mm -hmm. yes. that he has given us. And yes, yes as we get older, they hurt. <laughs> They don't yes. work the same. You, you know, you, you get on the floor and you try to get up and it takes a little more effort, but that's just part of getting older. It still doesn't take away from the wonder and the awe of the well, human body. Well, you know, we can't stay here forever. We He's got to, you know, we've got to be able to feel these things, so we want to leave yeah, we and go leave home. It's time to leave. <laughs> so, so, anyway, we hope this has helped. So let's just pray and wrap this up. Father yes. God, we just thank you, God, thank for you, making us the way you have we are just so incredibly created yes. so intricate intricately woven together god yes. it's beyond the comprehension of the human mind mm. the mind that you made that you gave us can't even comprehend the wonder of it all yes. so god we just we just praise you today we thank you yes. for making us and creating us the way you have done you made us from the dirt and yet we are we are just, we are incredibly, intricately, awesomely made. And we give you the honor and the glory and the praise for that today. We love you, God. There is none like you. There is none like you in heaven or on the earth or anywhere else, Father. And we just, we just thank you and we pray in the precious, mighty, awesome, powerful name of Jesus. Amen. 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 So, you know, maybe you're bored, sit there and open and close your hand and watch the <laughs> tendons move and, mm. and, you know, look at those blood vessels going through your arm and just, just be in awe. And just 
and just pay attention to sometimes even the answers that you give when you're not even thinking about them. They just yeah. pop out of your mouth. Your mind just spits them out. Yes. Right? Yes. Like even that in itself is just incredible. So we hope you've enjoyed this. Yeah. And if you share it and like it and pass it around, we'd appreciate it. You guys have a great rest of your yes. day. And until the next video, you take care and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.